Hi, Broadway babies. It's Ginger Minge here at BroadwayCon in New York City for LogoTV.com. We are here to see the best of the Great White Way and to celebrate all things musical theater with my fellow queens. So come with me and let's check it out. How are you? I'm good. I'm so much better knowing that one of my all-time favorite queens is here celebrating musical theater. Oh my god, who's here? Oh, um, Alaska. Oh god, she's always here. She's always on my trail. How are you? I'm the biggest fan, Ginger. I'm so happy you're here. Oh, I've heard you're the biggest fan. I love this place, actually. Everyone's walking around in costumes and mm. they're living it, you know? They're in the enchanted... World, I? I feel underdressed and understated. Are you enjoying Broadway Con? I am. It's so much fun. It's amazing and it's beautiful and it's overwhelming and it's all encompassing and the lectures, the vendors, you, it's just what a Broadway queen can hope for. A queen. A theater queen. A theater queen is someone, I suppose, who devours anything theater related. I uh, probably tries to catch every show they can. Someone who is willing to wait at a stage door in the rain to see your favorite divas. When you have that knowledge down and you know who and what and when and how and they first wrote the one on a napkin here and they met there and it was just a tinkling in their eye at first and then, I mean, this guy can give you backstory. My true theater queens, they can give you backstory like nothing you've ever heard and I'm that. That's a theater queen. Who do you think is the biggest diva out there right now? Well, diva is not a negative word. Never! I just want to be very clear. So for me, the ultimate diva is always Patti Lapone. Whenever I'm around Patti Lapone, I always just have to like pull myself together because it's, it's still, like I still get, I'm still that kid with the, you know, getting the Evita album out of the library and like listening to that vinyl over and over. So Patti Lapone is always number one. Shut up, Patti Lapone. Susan Egan. Susan Egan! I like you so much! I don't think that she's really your daughter. She must have sprung forth from my fake loins. Uh, it could be. Which Broadway diva is your favorite? Oh, uh, Audra McDonald. Audra McDonald. I think it doesn't get better than her. Don't worry, we won't tag anybody in this. You know what, I'm gonna say Harvey. Harvey. Harvey Fire. Thank you. Yeah. I've gotten a lot of Audra McDonald and I love her. I think I, she's fierce. I don't think she's but a Harvey. diva. She's like... A goddess. It's a little different. Like Just Audra a pinch. Is, is Can you own. explain for the children at home the difference between goddess and diva? Uh, diva is an attainable goal where goddess is something that you just ascend to. Work! Yeah. If you want to be uh, in show business and you have a passion for it and it's something you must do with your life, go for it. Falling for you. Got it! Well, that about wraps things up for us here at BroadwayCon 2017, but I'm sure there's a lot more in store theater-wise. So get out there and see a show, and make sure that you go to LogoTV.com for all of your Broadway needs. Now, the Tony Awards are around the corner, and that's usually where you can find me. <laughs> On the corner, not at the awards. But I'll see you there. <laughs>